beginning of this football season, there were some inexperienced referees handling the NFL games. Needless to say, not using the veterans was noticed. While I've often thought about the roles and responsibilities of the mobile DJ MC, this has helped me to share a more defined perspective. Let's compare the zebras of three major sports, baseball, basketball, and football, with your local disc jockey and how they are perceived and or noticed. I believe the least involved are the basketball referees as the game can go back and forth a number of times without anything having to be whistled or called. Yes, they must raise their hands with each basket, and especially with a three-pointer. But besides a foul or violation taking place, the game continues on. With football, every play is considered still in progress until a whistle blows. While many plays and even some games are determined by the referee's interpretation of the action or rules. Then there's baseball, in which every pitch and virtually every play is to be ruled on. So at this point, you might be thinking, okay, but how's this compare to playing music and being a DJ? In a number of ways, the two professions are on similar planes. All of these can determine or at the least will react and guide the rhythm and the flow of the event. If there are any questions or areas to be interpreted, these positions are usually looked at and expected to have the answers. DJs are often enlisted to supervise or oversee the event, much like referees. A large part of this responsibility is to see that the game or event is timely, smooth, and void of distractions, while allowing the focus to be on the players or guests of honor. Football refs and DJs both have microphone control. Umpires with balls and strikes and DJs with music played are both heard throughout the entire time. I do believe the basketball ref and a great DJ MC do have the most in common. When both are conducted properly in a professional, efficient, and experienced mode, they contribute to the fans, principal players, guests, additional staff, and hosts overall in complete experience. Here's the bottom line. When a referee doesn't blow a number of calls or screw up the game, the fans walk away saying that was great, and their attention and memories are about the game instead of talking about what the ref or ump did wrong. When you relate this to a DJ MC who connects with your group and event with a positive, in the moment approach, you and your guests leave wanting more and remembering a number of positive experiences instead of thinking about how the DJ didn't do this or you can't believe they played that. Less sometimes is more. Much like any ref, the less you see or notice a DJ MC is better. They are there to guide and lead your group without being that noticed or the center of attention, but confident enough to make the right call and keep the rhythm going when it's necessary to do so. I'm David Van Inger of Music in Motion, and this has been the MC Minute, or so.